Look at that car. I'm gonna try to take the drone off in this alleyway. A little concerned because the airplane flight pattern seems to be right right over there but I think if I stick within this general vicinity area I should be I should be okay I think but honestly who knows I added this little map right here. I don't know if you can see that. And uh, I've never flown with it before, but it actually, it helps because it tells me where I am, but it also tells me where I've flown, like my flight path and, and everything else. When you're flying a drone, you want as much information as you can get. I got everything I need, so uh, taking it home. Also, to give anybody watching this that may have never lived or visited Southern California, they have these back alleyways back behind the houses. So my parents' house is right here, and this is like a back alleyway for trash trucks to, to pick up stuff and for people to just, just park and, and stuff like that. Personally, growing up with this, I really I really do like it, and I wish more cities did that because my parents still have like a full front yard and a full like actual street that their house is on. Their real street is right down there. And this is the alleyway. This is just like an addition that Southern California does that uh, I was looking back at the footage and it kind of looked like a third world country. Not in a third world country. I'm uh, behind my parents' house in their, their driveway or alleyway. My mom ordered a new iPhone and we're picking it up in that line over there. That's why we're at Best Buy. We're actually not buying anything, it's, it's all my mom, so not today. Do you hear that? So I got this comment today and I wanted to talk about it. To give you a little context, the video was me talking about or showing you a groove that I was working on and it was particularly difficult and, and I was basically working through that in the video. The comment is, this stuff is way harder than playing fast. I'm more impressed when I see guys do stuff like this. Now don't get me wrong, going fast and doing things quickly is impressive and it's not easy. Like I'm not knocking that whatsoever, but I think that as drummers we kind of obsess over speed versus feel and I think feel is more more important in the long run especially if you're looking for employment or to seek making drums like a viable like job feel is a hundred times more important than just going faster chops because honestly in, in the context of like just real world uh, just jobs going fast only ever really works in like internet videos but as far as like going fast in like a band and it's not the right time or place for that you you may lose your job if you play in any kind of band you're gonna need to have good feeling you're gonna need to be able to gel with musicians which is part of having having good feeling being rock solid so because of that I think chops are cool and going fast is cool but something that's more important and people should focus on more, especially young drummers, is having good feel and being able to blend with a group a lot better. And if you can do that really well across different genres, that's way more impressive than going super fast on some random group you're doing for the internet. Somebody left their uh, dishwashing soap. <laughs> 